Here are 10 tips to improve your fitness and athletic performance for combat sports like MMA, BJJ, wrestling and boxing. Rather than spending hours on low intensity steady state cardio, perform at least one weekly high intensity interval training session to improve your gas tank. This can include resistance training, sprint intervals or intervals on a cardio machine like the assault bike or rower. Incorporate multi-joint exercises that target multiple muscle groups. Full body exercises increase the cardiovascular demands of your workouts and improve your cardio. Unilateral exercises target each side of your body individually. They will iron out muscle imbalances and improve your balance, coordination and proprioception. Plyometric exercises recruit fast twitch muscle fibers and enhance neuromuscular coordination. They will allow you to develop explosive power, speed, coordination and tendon stiffness. Perform rotational, anti-rotational, flexion and anti-flexion core exercises for sport-specific core strength and stability. Combine multiple exercises in supersets or tri-sets to mimic the physical and physiological demands of your combat sport. Aim for a 1 to 2 to 1 to 3 high intensity to low intensity ratio within your supersets or tri-sets. For example, perform a high intensity movement for 20 seconds followed by 40 seconds of a moderate to low intensity effort. And for a two to one to three to one work to rest ratio during your workouts. So going with the previous example, if you exert yourself for 60 seconds overall, aim for 20 to 30 seconds of rest. During your high intensity interval training, push your heart rate towards the red zone of 85 to 95% of your maximum heart rate. This will boost your anaerobic fitness as well as your VO2 max. If you're new to exercise or you have a history of heart disease, please get clearance from your doctor before following this protocol. Undulate your training intensity throughout the week. Alternate between high, medium and low intensity training days and take rest days and deload weeks where needed for adequate recovery. Check out this video right here to learn more about how to schedule and periodize your training throughout the week but also across multiple weeks and months. If you want to take your fitness as a fighter to the next level and you want the thinking taken out of it then check out my Combat Athlete 8 week bodyweight training and nutrition guide. Hit the link up here or in the video description and get started today. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.